Hi guys, I hope you had a great day at school today and I hope you're ready for a good bedtime story. This story comes from one of my favorite series. This is a How Do Dinosaurs book. So How Do Dinosaurs Choose Their Pets by Jane Yolen and Mark T. How does a dinosaur pick out his pet? Does he go on the prowl with a stick and a net? Does he head to the zoo and take home a big cat? And what does his mom have to say about that? Does she drag a huge elephant back in a wagon with both its long trunk and its wee tail a dragon? Or speaking of dragons, does she go acquire a high flying beastie who loves to breathe fire? Does he pick out a boa constrictor for play? Does it look at his dog in a very odd way? Does he sneak an iguana inside of a cap? Or lead home a kangaroo with a long strap? Does he ask for a manatee, maybe a whale? Or wish for a shark he can keep in a pail? Well, I don't know about you, but these don't sound like very good pets. Does she carry off tortoises, zebras, a mink, giving them hay and a cola to drink? Is that what you think? No, a dinosaur doesn't. She knows what to do. She never brings anything home from the zoo. He goes to a shelter or pet store or farm to find a small creature who will do no harm. He brings home a kitten or hamster or pup that he can teach manners as they both grow up. She cares for her pet and gives love even more. Big hugs to your friend, little dinosaur. Sweet dreams, guys. See you at school tomorrow.